The stakes couldn't get any higher in this fight because of what it means for each guy if they get a win. In a way, he's got to be in the top four. Any list you put together, right? Deservedly, yeah. But there are still some people out there that say, who? In a way, yeah. who is he for? Because they, they just simply don't, have not been following. Right. Then the other side, Fulton. He has been, I think he's the best at 122. If he wins this fight, which would be one of the better wins of the last 10 years, considering he's going on the road fighting a guy mm -hmm. uh, that has a slew of knockouts, he catapults himself into the top 10, potentially top five. Yeah. But right. if Inoue wins, I think he's number one. I think it's not, that's it. It's not like maybe it's Canelo, maybe it's uh, Fury, you know, maybe it's Spence. If Inoue wins, he's hands down number one. Fulton wins, he's in the top five. Hey, look up this young fighter called the Monster. Japanese fighter called Monk. Monk. He looks like a fucking pop star. Oh, wait till he get on these motherfuckers. <laughs> Game my fuck girl dirty D. In her jaw, she wanna break her head and edit like double D.